we're in this magnificent venue, the Signet Library, to mark the uh, Edinburgh Medal. It's a special moment in the, in the annual cycle of the Science Festival. The Edinburgh Medal is an, an award given to an individual or a group uh, to mark not only some great science that has been done by them or the group, but a wider contribution to society. This year we're here to uh, celebrate the work of Peter Higgs, of course, who lives here in Edinburgh and has done for most of his professional life, and uh, Ralph Dieter Hoyer from, the, uh, from CERN. Well, I think it's a big honour, and I take this honour, of course, for CERN and not for, for my own person, because it was a global effort to find this particle which is named after Peter Higgs, and it's really also an honour to receive this medal together with Peter Higgs. That's fantastic. It's a long journey of nearly 50 years. We are looking for the particle which he uh, postulated. We are looking for this particle since a long time. Peter Higgs and his uh, collaborators, they could predict all the properties of this particle. All its properties, except if it exists. Okay, that's a slight problem, okay. So we knew how to look for it, but we needed a much more powerful machine, which we now have with the, with the Large Hadron Collider, powerful enough and also from the energy and from the number of collisions. So, and that gave it to us. It's fantastic. And it gave it to us much, much earlier than I expected. These international collaborations worked fantastically together. The remark that I made, which introduced what's now called the Higgs boson, was put into the revised version of my paper after the original version, which was shorter and only about one page of A4, was rejected. <laughs> and so it could, if, if that first version had been, uh, r had been accepted, uh, no, nobody, I think, would, it, would ever have attached my name to the particle whose existence uh, I pointed out. The Science Festival is a different kind of thing from other festivals because it, as well as celebrating achievement and uh, communicating science, it also contacts the young and um, in a way which makes science an attractive career. And, uh, but it's also about science for everybody, uh, uh, making it accessible to all ages and families. So uh, we're very proud of it. I think it's, you know, it reflects the, the spirit of the Science Festival. It's a festival by the people, for the people and the Edinburgh Medal is that as well, I think.